Oh. Two down. What's up, my immune friends? This is KG4E, and welcome back to my Let's Play for Mist Survival. And I was just going home, and I noticed the sniper is up. He's uh, taking pop shots at me, and I'm just trying to get around behind the building to see if I can get his sniper rifle. All right, you'll, you'll know when he sees you because you'll see a little eye icon. And it just looks like a little eye. And uh, oh, yep, see. All right, I'm just gonna kind of rush down here and see if I can get down there without getting killed. All right, he did not get me. All right. So one thing that people are telling me in the uh, missed Discord is that the sniper. Um, sometimes is stuck on the stairs. The guy on the stairs trying to get up is the sniper. So maybe I'll take a couple more shots trying to get this guy. Um, today was going to be a building video, but um, if I can get the sniper rifle, it'll be a get the sniper video. Um, we'll see how see how it turns out. Uh, he's definitely up there. He's definitely up there. Come on, where is he? Is he starting to go down the stairs or something? Or Huh. Yeah, I think he goes down the stairs and he gets stuck. Dude, he's definitely up there, man. Oh, there he is. Okay, you son of a biscuit. I'm gonna get you. I'm gonna get you. Damn, where does he go? It's weird. Uh, he they kind of disappears. Let's walk off in the uh, uh, over there somewhere. Just kind of, kind of hang out. See if he pops back up. There he is. Oh boy. <laughs> Thank God he doesn't have that god aim anymore. He used to, you'd be dead normally. He used to have that god aim. Got him. Definitely got him there. Yep. Now, it doesn't look like he has any friends down here, which would be really nice. So I don't have to fight so many guys. I'm not seeing anybody. Let's hope we get the sniper rifle. Okay. Yeah, I'm not seeing anybody. I think he was alone. Very good. Yeah, sometimes, like, I would come over here and I'd see someone getting, like, stuck on these stairs. And that was him, apparently. There he is. No sniper rifle. I don't think he drops it. I think, uh... I think, like, you'll see it on the ground. Like, it's not on his body. You'll kind of see it on the ground. Oh, let's see. Sometimes he, sometimes when you shoot him, he, like... The sniper rifle will fall down here. What was that? Feather, I'll take that. Uh, the sniper rifle will, like, fall down here from up top. But it does not look like that is the case. Alright, fair enough. There you go. Boom. All right, so there's more guys down here. So we got a GTFO. I do not want to mess with anybody else. Got the sniper rifle, though. Did you see him? You saw him. He's stuck, right? Hell yeah. Freaking broken hunting rifle. We just got to repair it. Do we ever need to repair it? Honestly, I don't remember. All right, we got to get out of here in one piece. Oh, my God. They're right over there by my car. Two of them. Oh. Oh, boy. Oh man, they are right they are right by my vehicle. Huh. I'm gonna take the high ground over here. Yeah, I that only took a couple turns, right? I I um I killed him a couple times, and then the one you just saw was like maybe the third kill. So that wasn't so bad. And uh yeah, like I said, when I saw him walking on the stairs, like I didn't know that was I didn't know that was a sniper guy. When I saw him when I saw that guy walking on the stairs, I figured that was just um you know, just some bozo. <laughs> <laughs> now we gotta make it to our car. Oh boy, if we get killed, this is gonna suck. These guys ran over here. I don't know where they are, though. I don't remember exactly where I left my vehicle. I think it's this way. I think I went too far. Or maybe not. It's down here somewhere. They went right to my freaking truck. You believe that? Do you believe that? Shh. 
I have no idea where they are, and that is not good. Hoping they either despawned or maybe walk back to the base. Probably no such luck. They are probably at my vehicle. Like, oh, this looks like a nice vehicle. I think we'll uh, take this with us. All right, there's my truck. And no sign of them. Should I just make a beeline for the truck and drive away? Yeah, let's do it. Let's do it. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Go, 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 go. Go! Ho, ho, ho! You know what this calls for, people? A song. On the road again. Boo, do, 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 do. Just can't wait to get on the road again. Boo, do, 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 do. Something, something, something with my friends. I just can't wait to get on the road again. Hell yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Yeah, people keep telling me the lyrics to that song, and um, I think the something, something with my friends just makes it more funny. <laughs> it's not supposed to be serious. <laughs> Oh, I'm so freaking happy I got the sniper rifle. Oh, that is so sweet. Thank you. Thank you, Mist Discord. Because they told me in the in the Mist Discord. Yeah, he's gonna, you know, he gets stuck on the thing, and that's the that's sniper right there. So, you know, yeah, there you go. I mean, that's just freaking awesome. Hells to the freaking yeah. What up? What up, Rachel? Wait until you see what I got. It's gonna make your panties wet. All right, that was uncalled for. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm just in a good mood now. Alright, so let's see how we repair this thing. Uh, weapons... Uh, see... Yeah, there you go! Broken hunting rifle, we just need 16 components. I got 16 components. I got components coming out of my ears. 16 isn't even that much, two stacks. Beautiful! Beautiful! Come on! Come on, come on, come on! There you go, zero minutes! I like zero minutes. Boom! Hunting rifle. Awesome. All right, guys, I got this thing. I think I want to go snipe some bandits. So we're going to have to make some ammo for this bad mamma jamma. You stay in there. You're not coming out here. You're not coming out here with the big boys. You stay in there. All right. Um. Yeah, I, I want to shoot stuff. I want to shoot. I want to shoot randits right in their stupid randit faces. Um, so let's go ahead and make some 7.62. Oh, we need some low-quality metal. We need some... We gotta build a proper, um... You know... I don't know what you would call that. A proper smeltery, I guess. So, look at her. She's tired. Go to sleep. Take a nap, woman. You've earned it. I guess. I don't know what you do all day, but... I'm assuming you've done some interesting things, so... Go, ahead and go to sleep. Alright, so let's come on over here and... Oh, let's grab this off here. I need to take some time here. Excuse me. I need to take some time here and do some serious inventory management for reals. Because um, it's getting out of hand. It's been getting out of hand for a while. Alright, there we go. And 762, please. Um, 1632. Well, I can only make that much. 32 rounds? That's a lot for a sniper rifle. Yeah, 32 rounds will be fine. I need to make more... Um, some more brass. I think that's brass, right? Brass, right? I think so. Yeah, it's brass. Look at me remembering stuff. I need I need zinc. I don't I don't think I saw much zinc in the um in the new mine. So I might have to go to the old mine uh, for more zinc. How many times can I say zinc? Uh, there we go. Seven six two. Make it all, my friends. Make it all. We're gonna be shooting some randits today. Hell's yeah, we are. Oh boy, what a morning. Good night's sleep on the floor up there. I need, another thing I need to do is make a freaking proper bedroom. Oh my god, I'm sick of sleeping on the floor. Actually, I'm not really. Um, but I'm sure my character is. Alright, let's go see if we can... Oh, boy, hold on. <laughs> hold on. Let's go shoot some zombies, shall we? Or no, some uh, randits. Let me go kill ourselves some randits. Uh, so where is this other camp? I don't remember. I think it's up here somewhere. Or is it behind me? No, I'm pretty sure it's up here. Did I ever go up there and check that out? Let's go check that out really quick. Why not? See what this deal is. A lot of these, um, like, little POIs, like little miniature POI things are kind of abandoned. There's nothing here, but I think it's worth checking out just to, you know, make sure. Oh, there we go. We got some food. Alright, that was worth it. 
You may think, oh, it's just food, whatever, go kill a bear. Yeah, but I don't want to go kill a bear. I want to freaking do other things. So if there's stuff up here that can help me not have to kill the bear, then that would be awesome. Killing the bear is easy. It's just, you know, it's, it's not even really time consuming. It's somewhat time consuming, I guess. Is there anything up here? Hold on, I want to check this out really quick. Let's see what's going on up here. I don't think I've ever been up here. Oh. Well, okay then. Ooh, is that oh, God, Bandit Camp! Bandit Camp. Wait, is that have I ever been to that Bandit Camp? Hold on, I'm, I'm a little confused because the, um, the developer did change up the map. So, I don't know if I've ever been to this Bandit Camp. I don't know. Huh. I mean, like, I don't know. Maybe I have. There, there's usually a White House. Yeah, there's a White House up here. Oh. Oh, got him. All the way over here? Oh, okay. So, I am more... Remember um, way back in Season 1 when I found that, like, um, uh, military compound and there was, like, alien eggs in it? Like, giant alien eggs? Like, full-size, human-size alien eggs? That's where I am right now, and that it's been replaced with this, which is a travesty because that place is boring and there's nothing there. Um, <laughs> but, yeah, that's where I am. So I'm a little bit off the map on where I thought I was. And I might be at a bandit camp I've never been to, or maybe I'm a little bit confused on where I am on the map. But I do see bandits to shoot, and that's all I needed because I'm going to shoot me some bandits because it's fun. What's up here? Anything? Hmm. Pretty interesting areas, man. Holy crap, look at this. Look at this view. Wow, this thing really zooms in and zooms in quick. Alright, well. Let's uh, try and get the high ground on these randits. Now we gotta get down without hurting ourselves. <laughs> I think I'm kind of on the edge of the map where I probably shouldn't be. So, yeah. This might be the bandit camp I've been to before. That basically, there was like a little road off the main road, right? And it, it led to a White House, right? And not my White House, but a different White House. And if you went past it, there was a bandit camp up the road. That might be this bandit camp. And, you know, maybe I just, I don't know. I haven't been here. Maybe I've only been here once since he redid the map. So. Okay. Let's see if we can do some sniping. Oh, wow. No, this is not... The same bit. Oh, yeah, it is. There's the cage. And there's Scott. There's old Scotty boy, our tree chopper. All right. So I'm going to I want to kind of scout these guys out on where they are before I start plastering them. Plastering them. Blasting them. I only see one guy. I'm away from the stop. I don't like shooting guys on the, on the move. It's a lot harder to hit them. Also, those branches can, like, block your, your bullets. <laughs> They're super branches. Oh, here we go. Aim for the neck. Whoop. Two down. I don't know how many are there. Might only be two, I guess. I don't know. I don't see any other movement. Really? Just two guys? Unless the other guys are taking cover. Hmm. Alright. Let's go in. We're going in ham. Alright. I'm here to kill everyone. Except for Scott. Scott, you're okay. Really? Only two guys. Two guys guarding Scott. That seems a little off. Really? Scott is the most important NPC in this game. Alright, and I'm going to show you why next episode. But I'm telling you, he's he's legit. And uh, only having two guys guarding him is a... That is an oversight of epic proportions. My goodness. Oh. A bro oh, cool, I got a broken assault rifle. Awesome. So I think when eventually, when he gets the updates all pushed out to where he wants them to be, I think we're not going to get guns anymore. I think we're only going to get broken guns, and you got to repair them. Grenade fragments. Very good. All right. Well, let's loot this place up, man. This has been a hell of a freaking awesome episode, man. What's up, bro? 
Actually, there's two things I want Scott for. Uh, has been rescued. Yes. And we will take that. <laughs> I haven't even locked all my inventory spots yet. That's unlike me. Alright, I'm going to take this. Throw it down there. Now, the, um, the, the house I was talking about should be down there. Wait, what is that? It's right there. Oh god, this place is a lot closer than I thought. That's the um that's the military compound. The White House is right there. These guys were like my neighbors. They were like my neighbors. Now they're I don't know, they're dead. There's the house I was talking about. Oh wait, no, that's the that's the place I was at before. So they replaced the house that was down there with a little bit of a compound of a few buildings. Interesting. Okay. Alright, I like it. Let's loot this place up. Uh, anything on the roof up here? And nope. Nope. And nope. There seem to be a ton of stuff here. I don't, I'm not a fan of the baseball bat, by the way. No, not in this game. In other games, it's freaking legit. In this game, eh, not so much. What is else here? It's a very small little uh, base camp they got set up here. I can't believe Scott... Was in such a rinky dink freaking area. I mean, I thought he was gonna be all hard to get and stuff. Armor, crowbar. That it? I think that is just about it. I do declare. Yeah, looks about it. All right, let's head back to let's head back to base camp. Don't need gas. I'll take that. Hold on, let's not head back to base camp just yet. Am I supposed to be able to drive that car? It looks weird. It looks like what I'm supposed to be able to drive, but it's just kind of gutted out. Alright, I'm gonna go ahead and take apart these cars here and then head back home. Alright guys, we are back home and here Scott you might be wondering what that exclamation point is over his head. That, my friends, is a quest. Um, I believe it's going to help me repair that uh, fuse box at the uh, the new mine. We're not going to be doing that today, though. Um, we've already gotten a lot done today. Uh, we're going to continue building stuff in our base that is going to allow us to make things more efficiently and better. Um, as a matter of fact, I need a lot of um, a lot of wood planks. And as far as Scott's quest goes, that's going to be next video. All right, we'll definitely do that next video. Anyway, um, so I need to make planks uh, more efficiently than I do now, right? So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna make myself a saw machine. And uh, put that in here. Now, I'm gonna leave this as like a kitchen type thing. Oh, you know, I could put that right there. Nah, you know what, it won't even cover it up. Um, all right, I'm gonna put it in here then. I don't know which way is supposed to be the front. I think this is supposed to be the front. Yeah, that looks a little bit more like the front. There we go. That looks pretty decent. Okay, leave some room. There we go. I'm going to build this sucker up. Um, I am going to need some gears. Oh, God, I need a lot of stuff. <laughs> I need a lot of stuff. All right, so for gears, we take this. That should be enough for one gear. And we're going to kind of hop on out here and do the gear thing. Um, eventually, I'm going to have Scott do his special awesome thing, and we're going to be making a wall around this base. Um, so, but that's not right now. It's because I'm getting sick of having to hop out of my own base, it's kind of annoying. Um, although it's better than having the the AI come out. And the AI uh, supposedly does now close doors behind them. Uh, you know, we'll see about that. We will see about that. So let's go ahead and throw this in there. Now we need, uh, let's get the components and the wood. So this is what I'm talking about with the sawing of the wood. You only get four planks if you do this by hand and it takes a saw. If you do it in the, um, in that like automatic saw bench thing, which strangely enough doesn't take any power, um, you get five logs per, uh, four four planks per log. I know it doesn't seem like a big deal, but over the span of time, that, that helps out quite a bit. Uh, let's go ahead and have a soda before they go bad. Okay, and then throw these in there. And then we just need components and electrical parts. Electrical parts are, um, the best way to get electrical parts is by killing uh, zombies. And um, you don't want to farm them because they are going to be needed. 
Uh, wait, what I need? I forget. Oh, yeah, components. Um, they're going to be needed for lights. That's the main thing, that electrical... Um, what are they called? Electronic part. Um, it's going to be used for lights. Hey, hey, how's it going, Scott? Hey, like my new saw table. You're going to get you're gonna get used to this saw table, Scott. Let me tell you. As a matter of fact, I think we're going to have you get used to it right now. Let's have Scott saw up some, saw up some logs. Put them to work. There we go. A bunch of logs. As many as we can carry. We're going to need those um, those planks. I mean, we need lots of planks. A lot of freaking planks. So let's get in there and get him to work. All right. So if you want uh, if you want an NPC to do something, you simply set it up like so. And then you go to assign work to AI. And then right here, you choose the AI. All right, Scott, do it. Do it, buddy. Get to it. Make me happy. There he goes. There he goes. We're gonna have to start. We're gonna have these guys doing a lot of our work moving forward. Um, as a matter of fact, I might want to have her do some nails. Could always use nails. There you go, and you get to work now. Very good. Cool. Now the only person we're missing is Kate. There's one more survivor you can rescue, and that and that be Kate. So, all right. The reason I wanted planks though is because I would like to make a bed, a proper bed. All right, that's what this is. That's what this has all been about. So, in order to make a bed, we're going to come on in here, and we are going to grab. I don't know if I need. I don't think I need sewing kits for the bed. Uh, but we do need this. What else do we need for the bed? I'll make myself a big bed too, not some little dinky, you know, kid onesie, or, or a single bed. I'm going to do this one. So that'll leave some room for uh, for Rachel if she wants to join me, or Rachel and Kate. You know, um, Scott's not invited. All right, so we're gonna need um, some components. There we go, and we're gonna need some wood. Scott, how's that coming, man? Let's go. Come on, bro. Gotta be faster than that. How many did I need total? I think I needed ten, right? Ten planks. Yes. Damn, Scott. Um. All right, I'm just gonna sleep for an hour, I guess. Just kind of move Scott's ass. I need a chair in here. If you if you make chairs, you can like sit down and rest for like five minute stretches, you know, which is awesome. Um, otherwise, if you sleep, you're stuck, you know, sleeping for like an hour. And also, if uh, if too much stuff gets made in here, it starts piling up on top, which is kind of annoying. Although that was pretty painless. Sometimes the um, planks can get stuck behind the saw machine, and it's really really annoying. Um, I'm wondering if he patched that to fix it because that was pretty cool. They were just popped up on top. I like that. All right, so I've got the master bedroom because I am thy leader. And we're going to go ahead and do just like this. There we go. Kind of get that lined up as best we can. That looks pretty good. That looks pretty good. Okay. Let's go and build ourselves a bed. Yeah, it's a nice bed. I built my own bed when I was a kid at one point. Um, my mom uh, was dating a um, uh, a carpenter, and he, like we were moving in with him, and um, he's like, "Yeah, I don't have a bed for you. We're gonna build your bed." So we, him and I got together and built my bed. It's a good bed. All right, looking good. All right, so now we got a bed. Beautiful. Oh god, look at this. I think he patched this, guys. Look, none of these wood planks are falling behind. Like these things used to fall inside of the machine, and you couldn't pick them up. I think he fixed it. Raddy, you are a freaking... You are the man, Raddy. Raddy is the uh, developer. It's it's only one developer, too, which is why, like, when things go wrong, I tend to uh, be a little bit more forgiving with this game than maybe some others, you know? There we go. A lot of planks. Look at them all sitting on top. Oh, that's nice. Look at that. That is beautiful. Just beautiful. Your Kate's going to walk into the corner. Or, I'm sorry, Rachel. Okay, and there are my nails. Beautiful. All right. So I think next episode we are going to do Scott's quest. And the episode after that, we will probably show you Scott's awesome hidden talent. Although a lot of you guys, it's not a hidden talent. You all know about it. But it's, you guys are going to love it. I'd also like to do one more looting slash exploring video to kind of like, you know, get this thing taken care of. But that won't be next episode. Definitely won't be next episode. Anyway, guys, if you haven't been enjoying the video, please remember to uncage that like button. Also, if you're new here, please subscribe for more daily videos. Thank you very much for watching. I'll see you next time. And until then, take it easy. Mm -hmm.